I'm actually really gonna miss my room. Yeah, I just want to show you one last time and my favorite lamp. I've been here for six days now. Eating my last cup of tea. My stomach can't handle tap water. Since I'm awake already, I just want to show you one last time how the room looks like when I turn or switch on all the light. Which is down there, I have to use my foot. The option is to bend, but I'd rather not since I have a back condition. So, light number one. I love these lamps, they look so modern. Or just pretty funky and playful. Oh, there's light on, and there it is. There's my room for one last time. And my favorite lamp, which I had to transfer beside my bed so I could turn off the lights with my hand and not have to reach there. That actually belonged over here. Today, I'm gonna be making my last cup of tea, drinking my last micronutrients, and taking my last shower. I'm absolutely looking forward to being able to go home today, see my parents, see my dog. So let's have our macronutrients and finally start the day. This is my last bottle of water because it's my last day. I always, oops, I actually always struggle to open that one. Actually, so since today's a new day, I'm supposed to have a new bottle of water delivery. Actually, it's just not one bottle, they come in, in a pair. So let's go check out the door. Ta-da! Wow, cool. It's like getting it's like getting presents. Water. I feel like I feel like water particularly here is so valuable in the Philippines. I can't my stomach can't handle tap water. I feel like drinking water here in the Philippines is so valuable. My stomach can't handle tap water. Whereas while I was in the UK for almost three months, I was just drinking off a tap, which is great, off the faucet, the gripo. And it's just so nice to have access to clean water just straight off the faucet. So at home, we have this filter device, and yeah, we definitely do filter all our water. So here's my micronutrients. It's got all the good stuff, honestly. If you've seen my other videos, I did say what it has. It's got chlorophyll. Spirulina, it's got moringa or malunggay in Filipino. And since I don't like mixing it in my water glass because it turns green, I just do this. It doesn't taste the best if you're not used to this kind of stuff, but I promise there are other really good brands that are good for you. This one per se is not the original content because I just refilled it, but if you want to try, this is actually a, a good tasting one. If you're wondering what this is, this is my macronutrients. I drink this in case I don't have access to fresh vegetables or fruits or just, you know, fresh produce. So this for me can, um, this for me is jam packed with all the macronutrients or nutrients that your body needs to absorb because we all need vegetables. I'm actually really gonna miss my room. I've been here for six days now, and even if I'm so excited to see my mom, and my dad, and my dog, and my brother, I'm just, um, I'm definitely gonna miss this place. It's, uh, I've, I don't know, I just, I was very comfortable here. I was so at home. The floor is so spacious. I did yoga there. I also did yoga here. I also actually did yoga on the balcony. I meditated everywhere as well. Everything is so comfortable. I love this especially. This is like a speaker and um, a, like a night lamp as well. A night light we call it. And that's, this is my cinema area. I have my TV here and that's where I lay down. So my one pillow there is like my little table where I put my, my plate or my food on top. So I, I made my own cinema. And it's just so comfortable, especially the shower. I love, I love showering. I actually made a video on a full room tour. Do check that out if you really want to see everything in detail. But this is what the toilet looks like. Okay. <laughs> and I just, um, I've spent a lot of time taking nice warm showers there. So when I was in Scotland, it was so cold all the time. And I just didn't know what it was like wearing just a sando and shorts. I was always covered in so many layers of fabric. 
before I check out, I'm gonna call my mom and tell her about the good news because my parents are gonna be fetching me and I'm looking forward to seeing them. It's been so long. I wasn't able to spend Christmas and New Year's with them because I was abroad and I just can't wait to see them and I can't wait for them to pick me up. So with here, you can actually call any landline. Press 9. And then just dial your local number. Let's see what my mom has to say. I'm sure she's gonna be so excited. It's ringing. Maybe they left the house. Hello. Hi, Dada. Hey. So I got my results. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, I'm negative. Yeah, imagine that. Uh, well, where's the now? Where are you? Oh, my mom's upstairs. Oh, okay, dog. So what time? Parang ano late na lang. Like okay. If you've seen my other video, I did mention that it's quite hard to get hold of the front desk sometimes. Uh, I really don't know um, like why, but the receptionist said that if no one answers the phone at the receptionist in case I want to check out already, just to dial 5. So if you are staying here at the Picasso Hotel, just dial 5 and I guess that number is free to check out. I'm really not sure. I also spoke to the maintenance and they said if no one's answering the front desk, or the operator to dial 3061 and that goes directly to their uh, housekeeping headquarters it's a little um, insider experience so you know kind of what to expect if and when you do check in here my last quarantine hotel was the Seda Makati Hotel and it was superb and I can't even tell you the service was immaculate in fact they were giving me free food all the time my, my room didn't include food or breakfast and they would give me every morning I had breakfast and occasionally they would give me dinner and lunch imagine that so I was very very pleased however I love Picasso as well because I mean it's very it's a very comfortable stay and the staff is very friendly as well there's actually this note here as well that says um they only can assist you between 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. so anytime after 11 p.m. anytime between 11 p.m. to 6 a.m. Um, you won't be able to get hold of any operator so yeah <laughs> 